Well, this is crazy. Why is the washing machine working? It's not even plugged in. All right, let's get right into it. What's up, guys? How's it going? It's Kurt from Kurt's Cottage. Today, I'm working on an off-grid washing machine project. So it was a free find. The guy was just putting it out. He said it worked, but it had a small leak. So when I got home, it actually turned on. It worked for a while, and then it died. Basically, I want to convert this thing to run directly off of batteries, so there's no inverters and stuff like that. So the first thing we need to do is get a motor for this. So I actually have a lawnmower that's going to work perfectly. So let's get right into this video, and we'll tear down the mower, and then we're going to try to put the motor into this machine. The yard works 24 volt. 20 inch mower. Let's tear this down and get the motor out of it. Every screw is seized, so we're going to take another method. All right, so we have the motor here. It's a 24 volt motor, brushed, and it looks in good shape. I don't even really have to test this. I know it's gonna work. This is the most important thing. Oh man. Oh, it's so close. So we have to switch this around a little bit because if we don't, then the relay will not work properly. So now I've separated the field winding. I can connect it directly to this wire here. We're not going to be using this terminal here. We only want to use this one. So this can be disconnected. So we can switch this relay on and off with these two wires here, and then we can just switch the one wire on off. So it doesn't matter if this is going to be negative or positive, it doesn't really matter. So 
So I've rooted the wires out the back, just through the hole. It shouldn't touch the power unit here. And I've doubled up two 12 gauge wires. That'll give me about 40 amps. And then there's an eight gauge wire here. That's just the way the wire I had laying around. It was perfect. It was actually free fine wire from an air conditioner. Uh, we've got the 100 amp relay in here. Let's take a look at the back here. We have the air conditioning wire. Um, I gotta hook that up to the battery bank. So all we have to do is connect up these two wires here that'll click on the relay. So it doesn't matter which way we have the polarities here. Let's say that's positive and this is negative, then the motor's gonna spin one way. Well, if I switch it around and I run the negative to this, these two, and I run the positive to this one, then it'll spin the other way. Right, so I've hooked up the battery bank here. We have two 12 volt deep cycle batteries. You can use whatever you want, two car batteries. Doesn't really matter. As we'll take the battery charger off. Relay is hooked up. I have a switch. So what we can do now is hook up power. So we're not gonna know what is wash and what is spin is. So I'm just gonna hook them up. So we'll call this one negative. All right, guys, so we're hooked up. I'm not sure what about the polarity. This is the first test run. I don't know what's gonna happen. All right, this is it. Let's see, this could be spin or wash. Okay, so that is spin. Huh. Oh yeah, it's getting going. <laughs> oh man, oh, let's not blow this thing up yet. We gotta put the cover back on. Okay, so let's switch these wires now. Good enough. Whoa. that thing go. <laughs> oh man, that's definitely not a delicate cycle. But... Throw that in there, that sets it up a little bit. Throwing some clothes in. <laughs> All right, so it's washing. So I guess it's time to switch this over to spin. Turn on the spin cycle now. Let's see what happens. <laughs> There's too much water in it. Holy crap. Yeah, I think I put a, a little too much water in there. I've just dropped the hose down and let the water drain out. We'll try and see if it'll spin. Oh. Who's that? Okay, that was weird. I don't know whose dog that is. So it's drained out now. Thinking it's spun out pretty good now. 
So what you could do is you could shoot some water in to give it some extra rinsing, but I'm not going to bother with that. So I'm happy the project worked. So give it about a minute and it's done. It's spun right out. <laughs> All right guys, that was the washing machine converted over to run off of battery power. And thank you for watching.